Scientists discovered a 30,000 year old virus frozen in the Siberian wastelands. Let's defrost that sucker before climate change beats us to it. That's right, earth warmers. According to a 2015 study published in the Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences, a team of French researchers have unearthed a prehistoric virus from the late Stone Age buried deep in the Siberian permafrost. Dubbed Molivirus Sibiricum, or soft virus from Siberia, this bad boy stands out not only for its genetic complexity, but also its relatively gigantic size. I mean, it's still rather small, coming in at 0.6 microns, but anything larger than half a micron is visible via a traditional light microscope. Most viruses these days are less than a third that size and have to be studied with an electron microscope. And as far as genetic complexity goes, your standard flu virus runs a mere eight genes. Molivirus Sibiricum boasts more than 500. Another giant virus discovered in 2003, Pandora virus, has 2,500, far short of the human 20,000, but you get the idea. All told, we've unearthed four giant prehistoric viruses in the last 12 years. And I know this sounds a bit scary, perhaps summoning memories of the thing ripping through an Antarctic research station. But first of all, researchers only intend to resurrect this virus if it doesn't pose a threat to uh, contemporary organisms. And secondly, these viruses come from a mineral-rich area in a rapidly warming world. Climate change and industrialization are gonna unleash these antediluvian and viral life forms anyway, so science might as well get ahead of the game. Besides, these are not untested waters. Back in 2004, U.S. researchers revived the deadly Spanish flu virus so as to better understand how it killed between 50 and 100 million people back in 1918. If we can bring that back on our own terms, then we should be able to handle a few viral ancestors from a time when as few as a thousand humans lived in Eurasia. So where do you stand on all this? Do you still feel a bit squeamish? about the whole thing or are you good to go? Let me know in the comments below and be sure to like and subscribe if you want more weird now goodness popping up in your petri dish.